Exercise 1. In this warm-up exercise, we'll sum selected columns for the totals. We'll write a consistent formula that can be filled down and to the right. Equal sum ifs. Add up the current row, including the skinny column. Since we'll fill the formula down and to the right, we'll lock down the column references. Only include those columns where the column label since we'll fill the formula down and to the right, we'll lock down both the row and column references is equal to our column label. Since we're about to fill the formula down and to the right, we'll lock down the row reference. Close the function and hit enter. Looks good. Let's fill the formula down and to the right. Okay, let's spot check it. F2, okay, the references look good. F2, look good. F2, yep, looks good. As you can see, applying the sum ifs with the horizontal orientation is quite handy. Exercise 2. In this exercise, we'll compute quarterly subtotals with a consistent formula that can be filled down and to the right. Equal sum ifs, add up the current row, lock down the column references, only include those columns where the column label lock down the row and column references, is greater than or equal to the first day of the quarter. The first day of the quarter is computed with the eomonth function. eomonth, the column label, back it up three months, and add one day. And only include those columns where the column label, lock it down, is less than or equal to the last day of the quarter. The last day of the quarter is computed with the eomonth function. eomonth, the column label, and zero. Close the functions and hit enter. Fill the formula down and to the right. Let's spot check the cell references. F2, good. F2, good. F2 and good. Okay, I think we're good. Exercise 3. In this exercise, we'll prepare a report that breaks budget and actual values into their own columns. Let's look at the data for a moment. The data is stored in a table named TBL underscore ACT underscore BUD. The table contains both actual and budget data, as identified by the type column. We need to compare actual to budget in our report. We will write a consistent formula that can be filled down and to the right. Equal sum ifs, add up the amount column, only include those rows where the department column is equal to our department. Since we're going to fill the formula down and to the right, we'll lock down the column reference. and only include those rows where the type column is equal to our column label. Since we're going to fill the formula down and to the right, we'll lock down the row reference. Close the function and hit enter. Fill the formula down and to the right. Hey, I think we did it. Exercise 4. In this exercise, we'll split data into the proper region column. The data is stored in the table named TBL underscore item. Let's write the formulas to compute the report values. Equals sum ifs. Add up the table's amount column. Only include those rows where the item column is equal to our item. Since we're about to fill the formula down and to the right, we'll lock down the column reference. And only include those rows where the region column is equal to our region. Since we're about to fill the formula down and to the right, we'll lock down the row reference. Close the function and hit enter. Fill the formula down and to the right. And I think we're good. This video is a production of Click Consulting.